Hey guys, uh, Kevin the Rocket here. Um, as you can see down here, well, you can't really see it, but it is 12:31 a.m. Uh, can't sleep, I guess. So um, I'm downloading this. Uh, malware samples. I'm not really sure how much it is, but it seems like a box of 700 megabytes. So we're gonna take a look at this. Uh, I'll just go over a few things right now. My host PC, I'm running Colonial Internet Security Premium um, on the maximum settings that it is for active security. Um, and I also went to antivirus scanner settings and enabled the cloud scanning and enabled rootkit scanning and same with the scheduled scan. Um, Defense Plus, uh, sandbox settings, automatically detect drivers or any installers, updaters, and run them outside of the sandbox to make sure that's unchecked. Um, so yeah, basically I'm downloading this right now. Um, oh yeah, I'll go for my partner. Um, I actually got a new partner, um, Alexander. I don't know if you've ever seen his videos. Um, if you go to my channel. And you can see his name is right here. Antivirus Software is by ACA. ACCA. Um, as you can see, his first name is Alexander. He has 258 subscri subscribers. Um, he has uh, about 30 some of their videos, I believe. Um, they're just like mine. Um, so, yeah. He's a cool guy. Um, I've been friends with him for a while now, so uh, just be sure you add him as a friend or uh, subscribe to him. You'll uh, probably see us working together sometimes. Uh, it just depends. So, uh, yeah. So, I'll be back whenever this is finished downloading, I guess, and I guess I'll see you guys. Okay, we're back, and uh, right here in the corner it says... 32,813 samples. I'm going to boot up VMware and um, we're going to actually see how many um, files are in here. Uh, I think I'm going to test uh, Komodo Internet Security against this and see how many it gets. Uh, just because I use it on my own computer and a lot of people use it on their a lot of people use it on their um, host machines also. So, uh, yeah, so I'm just going to scan the file and I'll see how many it catches and how many it doesn't. Um, and, yeah, I guess that's it. I might, uh, if you guys want me to do any antiviruses, just tell me and I'll test it against this. Or a regular test, it doesn't matter, I'm just trying something different. Um, soon. I might be actually loading this uh, virtual machine up with malware and then uh, uh, trying to get it out with different programs and I'll show you the best programs to do that with. So uh, I'm going to transfer this file. I actually got to transfer my... Uh, one second. Gotta get this over here, and I might get this over here too. So I gotta transfer this, and I'll be back in a few minutes, so I'll see you guys then. Okay, guys, well, um, it actually uh, was dead, so I'm going to download another file from somewhere. I'm not really sure which site, but I'll tell you guys in a minute. And uh, after I get this downloaded, I'll be back in a minute, and I gotta line up my virtual machine so it's about right there. Okay, so I'll be back in a minute. Okay, um, right now uh, Komodo is updating. Um, and if uh, anybody out there is a good video designer, um, I could use an intro for my videos and um, if you can make me one that would be great. Um, also, uh, 
a watermark if somebody can make one or would like to make me one that would be nice but whatever it doesn't really matter um, I'm actually updating now the virus database but um, I got about five links here and I got some malware in here Um, I'll try to download one with 10,000 links um, or 10,000 pieces of malware. But uh, I'm actually gonna make a, a test tomorrow um, on the, uh, removal. Uh, I'm gonna get some advice with for some people or with some people, so I can do the test best and not screw anything up. And then I also got a TDSS right here. Um, my Trojan Win64 TDSS. So I'll see how this works. And I'll be back in a few minutes after this updates because I know I'm going to have to restart. So I guess I'll talk to you guys then. So see you then. Okay, right here I'm updating the actual program now. Um, I just updated the signatures. So I'm going to finish this and hopefully we'll get started on the test. So I guess I'll see you guys whenever I get back. Okay, the system just booted back up in that um, update. I'm going to check for updates one more time. And it is. Oh, wait, updates are available. Seven minutes though. So. Okay, so check one more time. Okay, and I'm gonna update the virus definitions. Okay, sorry about that. Okay, so we're up to date. Um, so basically, basically we have um, 122 files here. So let's start with the scan off by Komodo. So I'm gonna pause and I'll be back in a minute. Okay, I'm back and um, this is trying to access the internet. I'm gonna block it. Um, so let's see, we got 91 objects. And we're going to quarantine them. And I'll scan one more time. Actually, I forgot to um, put this on proactive. I forgot to change the scanner setting, enable cloud scanning, enable group hit. I also forgot to change this. Okay, so every time I run a system with Komodo, I always change it. So, change one more, scan one more time, see what happens. Okay, so it's finished, and it has 34 objects, I guess. So 31. I think it was 121. Let me make sure. Twenty two. So one twenty two minus thirty one. So 
So 91% of the files are removed. That's good. Um, I'm actually going to scan this and see what happens. Detergent TESS. I'm actually going to run these first and I'll extract it and look at it. So let's get started with these. I got a few trojans, a few antiviruses, fake antiviruses that is. And of course this one's dead already. Okay. So the cloud scanner alert. I'm going to clean. And that was a fake AV. Plus it was isolated by the way. Okay, this site is blocked. I'm going to disregard and continue anyways. Let's see what happens. Looks like nothing. This is a fake antivirus, which is dead. I'm going to grab three more links. Okay, this one's detected, so clean. Let's go to Google and Malco. door, clean. So I might be a fake AV. And I'll get one more. I'm going to block this. Okay, so those were all detected. Okay, and it, the second we tried to uh, extract that Trojanware 132 rootkit. So that's excellent rootkit detected. Um, actually, unclassified malware. So uh, yeah, but um, basically you always want to go in here in scanner settings and then enable rootkit scanning, enable rootkit scanning. That's not enabled by default, um, but yeah, so looks like Komodo did a pretty good job. Uh, I'll run a full scan with it. Um, other than that, I'm not going to do anything else because for everything else, I did not do it. Um, I didn't scan with my tools, so I'm just going to let this run and I'll be back in a few minutes. So I'll see you guys. Later. Okay, I'm still waiting on the scan to finish, but uh, next in line, I'm pretty sure I'm going to do a um, removal of malware whenever, let's say, somebody 
goes to a bunch of websites and gets malware, doesn't even know it. They could be having a key loader on their computer, key loading all the passwords, everything like that. Big antiviruses, slowing it down, pop ups, redirections, uh, proxy servers installed, it just depends, whatever. And uh, I'll show you guys how to remove all that stuff. Um, but yeah, basically, uh, yeah, that's basically it. And then after that, I think I'm going to test Adware and then maybe Malware Destroyer, I think it is. I was just looking through Google and stuff, and I come across that. I wonder if these. I can see right now the. Um, it's scanning right now. I don't know if it's scanning this zipped up folder or what because it's got 31. It's actually in the users folder. So, yeah, desktop. Hopefully this will finish soon. And um, not really sure about Adware because the last time I used it, the last live um, detection thing I think it said was, um, I believe in 1969 it said or something like that. Kind of outrageous, but just we're gonna clean. See, I'm talking about keyloggers, which is like, um, just say 2010 Stiller. I'm sure it might be. Um, an Ampo Stiller, which is whenever you just say log on to MSN, it'll log your password and somebody can hack your account that way, or your email, or Facebook, or whatever you have. Um, so, yeah, basically, I'm going to. Uh, next test, I'm going to load up like malware just like all these and uh, without antivirus first, and then I'm going to download some programs off the computer or off the internet if I can access the internet. Let me say that and uh, I'll go from there. But yeah, that's basically it for now. Um, please comment, rate, and subscribe, and I guess I'll catch you guys later. Have a good night.